welcome back to Dairy Ears. I got my jingling earrings on again. <laughs> Trying to get in the spirit. I'm at my daughter's house. Raquel's here. And uh, she's got a lot going on personally. <laughs> So I'm trying to keep her busy and keep her mind off of it. So I said I'd come in and wrap some gifts. So that's what I'm going to do for today. And that way she doesn't have to do it after all. So anyway, I tried to uh, find my stuff to do my candy that I wanted to do that I've been telling you guys about. And I think that my husband ate my pretzels because I can't find them anywhere, you guys. So I'm gonna stop off at the store tonight and get some more. So, then I'll be able to get that done. Cause I, get, I do it for the kids anyway and I send them off to my, um, my niece and my great niece and nephews for Christmas anyway. So I have to get them done. That's just the way that goes. So I'm going to do it for you. I'll make sure I get it done. Raquel is going to hopefully buy probably, I don't know, I'm hoping by midnight tonight, but that's way too soon. Um, tomorrow morning or tomorrow afternoon, early, I'm guessing, maybe. Um, maybe I'll be a grandma. So, I mean, I'm not sure when, but it's going to be fairly soon. We've got everything ready. The bag's packed. She's got snacks for her baby cakes. That's uh keep him all nourished <laughs> so he's got energy <laughs> for this situation. <laughs> Maybe we'll keep him from being nervous too. I don't know. But she decided to go get him some good snacks that he likes. And uh he'll be he'll be all okay. And I'll be I'll be close by anyway. So if he needs backup I'll be there. We'll try to let these guys do most of the stuff by themselves and and stay out of their hair since it's their situation but I'd like to be there when the baby's born. We'll see if that works out or not. may not work out. You never know. Life's, different things happen in life and you never know how things roll. So it might go super fast and I might miss it. You never can tell. So we'll see. But y'all better pray that I make it. <laughs> that I get to be and see that little baby born. I can't stand it. I'm gonna stay in here tonight because with all of our preparations and making sure everything was ready, I was sitting here having coffee with Raquel yesterday morning and I said, well, I guess we aren't ready yet. I mean, we forgot one thing. And she said, what? And I said, well, we forgot Leroy. Show him Leroy, Raquel. <laughs> he was down there looking at his paws. It's like, somebody's gotta be home with Leroy. Gotta let him out. He can't just be here all night long by himself overnight and you know, until the extended day. I mean, if you have a baby, it could take forever. So they could be gone for a long time. I don't want to say that too much around Raquel. She's hoping it goes pretty fast. <laughs> but I took, when I had her, all my kids were generally about 11 and a half hours of labor. So she particularly didn't want to hear that. <laughs> so I got my granddaughter, this little mermaid uh, doll that goes in the bathtub and her tail all lights up. So She'll just think that's fabulous. Let me get that wrapped up in this. I think I'm gonna do a different color for each gift, different paper for each gift. That'll keep her. So yeah, I'm gonna do a different, a gift in a, each gift in a different color wrapper. Do you think I could cut paper and talk at the same time, right guys? It's cause I got too much going on. I can hardly think about anything else but this baby. It's ridiculous. Anyway, all right, so I'm going to wrap this little Barbie in this one, and this one's got deer on it and woodland animals, so she'll love that because she's all into critters anyway. Hopefully I gave myself enough room. Yes, I did. Okay. We got this paper at Walmart, I think. It's pretty thin. Usually they have thicker paper than this, but okay, that's all right. I'll get her done. One thing I can do is wrap a gift. That's for sure. So this has a funky side on it. It's got a lip that's kind of thick. 
on one side, but not on the other. So I'm just gonna go like this, fold it in like this, fold it over. For all you people who have trouble folding things or wrapping this at Christmas time, it's not that hard, guys. <clears throat> just kind of make clean lines and you'll be okay. It doesn't even matter how many clean lines you get, as long as you uh, make it a clean line, it'll look good. That's all right. The side kind of ripped a little bit there. That's okay. Same thing. Take that. And then we'll fold this in. Take this side. Fold it in. Fold it over. Kind of hold my finger there. Get two pieces of tape. Push this down. So it's a good spot. And there's not a big old spot there that's sticking up. Put that down there. Put that down there. Ta -da! Now, because she's two, working on three, I'm gonna put just a little bit more because she's a sneaky little critter. <laughs> when she gets ideas, she wants something. She doesn't like to stop. So, I have to put a little extra tape on it, I think, just to reinforce this because one thing I know was my granddaughter. <laughs> She's just like my sister Charlotte with that Christmas gift type of thing. So, <laughs> gotta watch it. Okay, the next thing is I got her this little guy. Because I thought her Barbies are going to need a guy, you know. Why not? So I got him some clothes for the beach too because he's a soccer guy. So he's going to have to have another outfit, you know. So I'm going to actually put those... Do you think I should put them together or do you think I should se separate them? Separate. You think she'll get it if she gets them separated? That is for him? Or should I just put it with them? I'd put it with it. That's what I think. I agree with you. All right, we're going to do this one. I'm gonna do a red one. Cause after all that's exciting, especially if you're two. So, and I think, See if this will take care of it. I don't know if it will. Yeah, I think I could probably get it done with that. All right, go this way. See how wide I need to make it? About right there. I uh, actually had to go back to the store because I was going to buy her a Moana doll, and when I looked at them, they were five bucks. So I'm like. There is no way a Moana doll is going to be five bucks. They got that marker on them. So I thought, well, if they are, I'll find it online. So I went home and I got online and yes, they were, they were five bucks. I thought somebody must have put it in the wrong place because there was only one hanging there. So I didn't get it at the store when I saw it like that. Because I thought, well, so anyway, got online at uh, walmart.com and they were actually five bucks. So ordered one and picked it up in the car real quick the other night before I left here. So, there we go. <laughs> so I tape to the side of the table. So, mostly, I did just Barbies for her this year. Um, I did get one other gift. Um, I got her a little sleeping bag thing. It's like a roll that you roll out, and it's got a bunch of woodland animals on it. It's real cute. It's got a built-in pillow. And it's got a little blanket thing that she can throw over herself. And she's all into, like, laying on the floor and watching TV or something, you know, chilling out. Sometimes she just likes to lay on the floor and just, while people are in the room talking or whatever, she can chill out when she gets a little tired. So, that was exactly a Davina gift. So that's what I did there. And I'll wrap that um, probably tomorrow because I didn't bring it in with me. Here's that one. Then, my sister got her, um, or my daughter got her, a little dollhouse and they had these little Barbies they're the Chelsea's 
we should actually give him names because he's a little guy and he needs a name. These are like this little Chelsea dolls. So it's a girl and a boy for the little dollhouse. So I'm gonna put those in probably the green one. No, 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 not the green one. We'll go with, we'll go with red again. I think that sounds good. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, wrap them for Michelle. That way Michelle's working all the time. So I'm gonna wrap these two. And then I'll show you the big, the, the big deal gift that, <laughs> it's not like a big gift or anything, but for her it will be because you gotta know how she is and what she likes. It'll be fun to watch her even get it because she gets so excited about stuff. We'll tape the end about up. Okay. All right. She'll be excited about this too. Um, she's like likes people, likes uh, like the dolls and stuff to play with, like their people. So that's a big thing to her. So I tried to stick along that line because I've gotten her other stuff already throughout the year and she doesn't need any more of that kind of thing. So and I bought her a dress for Christmas already. So we're good there. And uh, she's gonna have the doll house. So she'll want dolls to play with in that. So I got those. But it gives her a little bit of a different kind of doll each time. I tried to make it so that she can do different things with them. So there's that little one. And hopefully I can get this little fella in here. I don't know if they'll fit. I'll turn it this way. Mm, barely. She's two and she ain't gonna know the difference if it's missing like a quarter of an inch. So we're doing it. <laughs> she is not gonna care. <laughs> At all. You know, I'd be surprised anyway if these guys made it that long. Because I'm telling you, I don't know if she could handle it. She's one of those types that she's going to want to open them as soon as she sees them, probably. You know, and it'll probably be all we can do to get her to understand that she can't. So, <laughs> there's that. <laughs> Yeah, you might have to wait a little bit to put them under the tree. Maybe, yeah. <laughs> She's a. <laughs> She'll be so excited she won't be able to stand it. So, yeah, she probably will. Or maybe put one under there and, and see what happens. Maybe we can do that. Yeah. Yeah. Because, shoot, that might be just overload for her. Yeah, I don't know if she could handle it. <laughs> <laughs> I remember being that little. I never uh, got into my gifts when I was a kid ever but my sisters did <laughs> and one year they tried on other stuff that my mom got them and then we're at dinner table and my dog my dad came home from work and mom and we're all sitting there and, and we're eating i remember plain as day because we had macaroni and cheese and i just stabbed my macaroni and cheese and my sister goes mom my tennis shoes don't fit me and i was like oh no <laughs> she goes what are you talking about mom said <laughs> Oh God, you stepped in it big time. So here's Moana, and this is Davina's favorite. She loves the Moana movie. So I had to get her. I was like, she's gonna love it. And then I found a little necklace at the secondhand store that is a, a little blue stone, and she's gonna just love it. She's gonna be so excited, she won't be able to stand it. I know her too well. She loves Moana, loves her. I'm put this one in the animals okay. Not like that. but yeah she'll be so excited about that i guess we're gonna have to put like the guy we'll put the soccer guy under the tree and then if she rips into it at least that's going to be the least exciting gift for her <laughs> so we can say the ones that are like real exciting for christmas day but we gotta pray she doesn't get into it but I know she, she, she'll get mad about it. She will, and she'll pout. She'll, she's a powder, man. She'll throw her little hissy fit and get mad at us, and she won't talk to us. So that's what she does. When she gets mad, she just won't have nothing to do with you then. Like, that's it. She writes you off. You're done. <laughs> it's 
too funny. And sometimes if she's too bad about it, I go, do you just need to go to bed, take a nap? And she'll look at me. And then she'll just kind of wander off. <laughs> she's the smartest little thing, I swear. She's smart as a whip. Well, she's also stubborn. She will not tell you how old she is. She just won't do it. She knows how old she is. But she just started. She will finally tell you. Did she finally? <laughs> oh, I tried to put on um, another show the other day where a kid was saying how old they were. And I, I let her watch it like several times. Like I kept backing it up over there, you know. And I say, how are you? How are you? And I thought, maybe if she sees this kid saying it, it'll be like, okay, not, it's not so bad. It's no big deal, you know. But... Yeah, I finally got her to start saying it. She'll answer you now. Well, she's good. I'm glad. God, I, I mean, we've been working on that for months. I know. <laughs> she's stubborn, that one. I'm going to tell you, she is stubborn. <laughs> and then we've got this new one coming. So, the jealousy, we don't know what's going to happen there. We're gonna wait and see how it's gonna turn out. She might be super ultra jealous. So we'll have to see. My finger I can't really bend it that way. Here we go. Okay, that one's done. And then the ultra one, because there's one thing you need to know about my granddaughter ever. She loves chickens. <laughs> she loves them. They live in town, they don't have chickens. She loves chickens, so I had to get her the Barbie with the chickens. Oh, you gosh. That's, I had to run through hoops to get this. I finally got off uh, eBay, and they ran out of them on um, Amazon, and then Walmart went from, like, their price keeps fluctuating. It was 22 then it went to 40 then it went to 54 and then it went to 94 and I had already put this into my uh, cart, thank goodness, on eBay, so I just went ahead and bought it because I thought, well, I, maybe I'll get a deal if I go on eBay, but... Um, that's as much as it is regularly new, so um, it wasn't really a deal, but well, at least I got it. And then I looked on there again today at, at Kmart, and they had them um, at 40. So it depends on what day of the week it is, I guess, you guys, and how many they have in stock, because I think when they get close to running out, they really jack the price up. I was kind of shocked. But at least I got it for them. She loves chickens. She has stuffed chickens. She has chicken balloons. I didn't even know they existed. Chicken balloons. That kid, something else. But yeah, she loves her chickens. So Grandma got her this. But she doesn't know these come from Grandma. These are just going to be over here under the tree. I'm going to, Grandma's going to be getting her the, um, the little, like, what do you call it? Sleeping bag thing. That's all she thinks is going to come from me. Because <laughs> I like to just put them under the, the tree or put them out and make it look like Santa Claus brought them or whatever, you know. Or they could, the kids don't even have to buy them as much Christmas because I got these. I mean, they can save their money. I mean, they're having a new baby after all. They spend their money on other stuff, I'm sure. So they can do what they want. But she'll have the gifts still. Put this right here. So I'm going to stop by the store and see if I can get that stuff for you guys and uh, before I head home today. And then when I get home, hopefully I can make those candies I want to, oops, got this one goes on top, there we go, that I wanted to make. So I thought it'd be fun to make them. They're so easy and the kids love them. Love them. I think it's because they're pretty, you know. Leroy, you can't have that. Oh, it's because they taste good. <laughs> <laughs> you can't have that. Leroy, he That's is. not He's food. trying to eat the wrapping paper. I know it. When did you start eating wrapping paper, boy? Oops. Stuck in my finger. All right. Okay, guys. Venus Christmas is pretty much done. <laughs> All right. We'll see you guys later. Take care and Merry Christmas. <laughs> Bye.